Here are my top do's and don'ts for charging your smartphone properly. I'm Kurt the Cyber Guy, and if you got an iPhone or Android, I'm talking to you. You may notice sometimes the battery dies more quickly on some days rather than other days. And you may not even realize that some of the ways you're charging your phone can actually do more harm than good. Be sure to follow these steps while charging your device. Number one, did you know that it matters what type of charger you're using? If you're using a plug that you bought from a discount type dollar store, the low quality charger could actually be depleting the battery more quickly than it's charging it. Not only are they bad for the battery health of your phone, but low quality or knockoff chargers could lead potentially to fire hazards. So be sure to use higher quality chargers from your phone's provider or only chargers which have met safety certifications from credible institutions such as Underwriters Laboratory. You'll see the little UL, even if they cost a few more bucks. Next, check to make sure that you're closing out of or deleting apps that drain your phone's battery. This is gonna help a lot in your phone's battery health on a daily basis. The result also is gonna help your charge last a lot longer. On both iPhone and Android, you can swipe up on apps to close them, which stops them from using your precious power reserves while running in the background when you're not even using them. Finally, don't strain your phone's battery by charging it too fully or by letting it die all the way. If you charge your phone all the way up to 100%, unplug it after. Leaving it plugged in can stress out your phone's battery. Letting it fully die will do the same thing as it then must completely reboot. For more ways to protect and prolong the life of your devices you use every day, head to cyberguy.com and sign up for my free newsletter.